Hey guys, welcome back. So guys, in this video, we are continuing our Laravel Vue.js with Vuex series. And now guys, in this video, we'll be learning how to make a search box in our Vue.js Vuex. Okay. So guys, let's get started. So first, let's move to our this table component, student table component at this search box. Okay. Okay. And let's move to the search button. Here is our search button guys. Okay. Type to search. So let's copy this model that search query copy and go below here inside the data function. We have assigned that search query also. And before this data function, you have to call the watch. So whenever we search directly, we have to check the data. So we should put under watch function. So open and close curly brace give comma and inside this you can assign the search query colon function function open and close where so from this function you are going to get all the val i mean that where whatever you type inside this so you'll get the data so once if you get the data we have to fetch these records so what we are going to use the same dispatch function to get the data but with the search query so let's use the same dispatch this dispatch get student okay so same data but we are going to integrate this one more thing that is our like search query not this dot search colon this dot search query okay so this dot search query is nothing but your data so you will get from here and you are going to send it in your get students so same will let's copy this and assign this in your mounted also because we wanted to fetch the search data so you have to work like this if you are not understanding this how it is set you have to watch the part one the link is given in the description so you can watch from there how we are setting this and then you can come to this search module all set and now guys let's go to this get function i mean get student of dispatch so let's move to our action.js and here is the get function okay get student make sure it is the same so yes it is correct let's get back and inside this the payload you are going to send it so you need to send over here so right now we were just calling the data and sending it but we are going to use search options so whatever we get from there we have to send it directly over here so that is we are using post method to send the data so let's save no changes guys and now guys when you send the request whatever you are sending the actual request with this payload okay so what is in the payload so as you can see that we are sending this query so we are posting the data so you will get an input of search query so guys now let's write the code into our controller so let's move to this what is that url get students data so let's copy this and search with that in our web route perfect so this is the route guys and let's move to this controller at the function fetch student data so right now it's written that we have to fetch all the data now guys we will be give a condition over here so let's make something like query okay so this will be the query and if if you get any request so dollar request before that we have to assign the request over here because we are getting a request with the post method of search data a request of what a request of let's move to table component this code so let's copy this search query get back to your controller paste if it is like data is there then you'll get inside dollar query of where condition we are using query builders in laravel so use a function use use dollar request inside this you are going to give dollar q this dollar q you are going to use it 
or where like what 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 are the things one is name okay let me close this first it's closed over here let me just remove this all set guys where you are going to give the condition that is like comma inside single code you are going to use percentage dot dollar request of what your search query whatever data you are getting from there and you are going to assign it so now you are going to dollar students students is equal to your dollar query of get function so now this value you are going to remove instead of all let me just comment and keep it for the reference so over here you are going to select what are the fields you want let me just rename this as students we'll just leave that so what it was before and select what are the fields so by default you have to select id that is compulsory and then your fields so let me just show you so my fields is over your name class section email okay so these four fields i require it name comma class comma section and the email so these are the fields which i need let's save and then guys you're going to use get function and return now let's see the output refresh okay perfect so there is no issue with working on this fetching the data and now guys let's try with searching i am going to type bca and here you find no data okay ped perfect so we are only searching with the name why bca did not found you can see that we have written a query here is the query only we are searching with the name okay so that means you are going to search only the name next is varun or let's search with the mahesh you can find that mahesh over here perfect so if you want like you want to find from the class also so in that case guys you just need to copy and paste this and just class if you want email add email okay save and all done let's once refresh not required but okay so let's search with the email guys with at gmail.com we are getting let's search with bca so these are the bca students let's search with the bcom and these are two bcom students so guys this is how we implement our search box in our laravel vue.js with vuex so we are using vuex in this crash course guys so guys in this video that's it and we have completed with this series and now let's see with adding more up so guys thank you for watching this video Please subscribe, like and share.